Welcome back to Eco Styles. This is the part two of Aruba vlog. And yes, we're gonna start strong with the Flamingo Beach. Flamingo Beach, it is uh, located on the Renaissance Island, which is owned by Renaissance Hotel Marriott. And the flamingos are not wild there. They just brought it, I believe. But there were a lot of birds on this island, the pelicans and very funny looking pigeons. I will maybe pop up picture if I can find it. So first we went to Iguana Beach without knowing that was Iguana Beach. So of course, we found a way to get to Flamingo Beach. Those flamingos were actually so pink, like orange pink. It was beautiful, but there were some that was like more or less pink, which you're gonna see later. Oh, there they They're big for a reason. <laughs> uh, with, I believe, 25 cents, uh, you can feed the flamingos you can get the uh their food and uh, we spend like a dollar per cup and which lasts enough time they were really friendly i would say they were not afraid of you i wanted to touch them but they didn't like it and here camera changed to gopro because i'm going into the water name of this prize it was some like beats it was amazing with the entrance ticket includes one drinks and one meal i had octopus salad and he had ribs and that was it for the flamingo beach but stick around i have some more things to show you another 10 six minutes and this is my favorite beach in aruba eagle beach but you gotta go a little bit more south of Eagle Beach, which is near Coco Loco Bar, Beach Bar. It was more quiet, wider sand, softer sand, and clear water. It was very peaceful. And we rented an umbrella near Coco Loco Beach Bar. It was, I think, 25 US dollars. And we... <laughs> When both of us failed to pop champagne. <laughs> we both did the same. Usually it's so hard to pull out. So we had a champagne while watching sunset. It was beautiful.
And nighttime. This is another outfit. The Zara dress, which is old one. I wore it in Euro trip as well. Of course, cost per wear is important. And we went to Gianni's. I didn't even want to mention this restaurant. It was such hyped up. However, the food itself was okay, especially compared to the price, also it was super duper busy, so, you know. The appetizer came in so quick. And that was the pasta we ordered, I ordered seafood pasta. I love mojito, as you can tell. <laughs> And we went to a local bar, I couldn't find where it was, but it was really nice. I had the best mojito here. The bartender, she was from Colombia, she was so funny, friendly girl. And yeah, we had a tequila, and then after that, we went to a different club called Mills, or Red Mills. And this is the next day, it rained hard. And it doesn't have great drain system, so yeah, we were worried about our rental car. But we made it. So first, we made it to Turtle Beach. It's a perfect spot for snorkeling, I believe, but we didn't go in. And then we went to Arashi Beach. It was a little bit more calm earlier than the day, but I didn't take videos until later, which became a tiny bit wavier. And then because it got wavy, it's not as clear, but it was definitely more clear earlier. I felt like it was saltier water. Then here is how it looks in the water. You know, it's still amazing. It's so warm. And here the umbrella was about 20 US dollars. And for dinner we went to Papiamento, which is a language they speak, I believe. I thought it was Italian restaurant, but it's uh, like local cuisine, I, yeah. It was in the forest, and there was a menu called Ayaka. I had Ayaka, it was spicy. <laughs> It started to rain pretty hard. We were okay under the umbrella, especially compared to others, but they gave us a tablecloth. And Victoria had a pork chop. Mermaid? Thank you. Thank you. Shrimp. Mermaid. Oh, shrimp. Shrimp and a fish. Oh yeah? Mm-hmm. Oh. Wahoo fish. <laughs> it was actually great. It came on the hot stone, so you would cook them as you eat. It was great for fish, but I so LT had lamb chop and at the end it was overcooked. It kept cooking, you know. And Andy had shrimp, which was great. They had a basil turtle sauce. And next day again, this is my favorite bathing suit, Andy hiding. <laughs> and we went back to Eagle Beach, but near Passion on the Beach, so it's a little bit like northern Eagle Beach. And we had food while watching World Cup. And this was the last day. Pelican Pier. Back at it, yes, this is a calamari I was talking about, and we had a coconut curry, and then we found the starfish. So that's yeah. it for Aruba vlog. I hope you enjoyed it. If you have any questions, please do let me know. I will try my best to answer. Thank you so much for watching till then, and I will see you in the next one. Bye now.